somewhat recently, you said you'd defeat uh, LaMelo Ball in a one-on-one -on -one situation. Uh, say that did happen. What do you think you would do better than LaMelo in a one-on-one -on -one situation? Um, I just think he can't guard me. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, like, my ability to shoot the ball, you know what I'm saying, for so deep, I don't think he can guard me. I'm on live, man. What's up? What's up, man? Watch out. All right. And, um, yeah, so, yeah, I just think he can't guard me. And, and um, especially if I get the ball first, yeah, I don't think he'd be able to, you know what I'm saying, stand in front of me and hold me, honestly. Yeah, he, you think it would you think it'd be a close matchup? Yeah, no, nah, I think he's close. He's definitely tough. You know what I'm saying he's number one pick. <laughs> As my yeah. boy, he's cool. You know what I'm saying, but nah, it'd definitely be a great game. You know what I'm saying, but if he get the ball first, you know what I'm saying he bully me to the rim. You know what I'm saying he might win, but nah, I don't, I don't think it can go like that though. <laughs> Who would you say the toughest? What's good, y'all? It's King Tees. Welcome back to Throughout the Association, and Julian Newman is back with the foolishness. As you guys just saw in the interview with Lambo Media, and shout out to him, Julian Newman just told us he believes he can beat LaMelo Ball one-on-one -on -one because he feel like LaMelo can't guard him. Now, I guess this is the confidence he should have in a way, but sometimes confidence can turn into delusion, and this might be one of those cases. This is not the first time Julian Newman has said this. Julian Newman playing LaMelo Ball one-on-one. -on -one. I guess he's on the right path. I mean, LaMelo really, realistically, wouldn't have to guard him. I mean, he could just let him drive right by him every time and block him at the rim, as we saw him do already. LaMelo, what, 6'8"? Julian Newman about three foot five on a good day in the right shoes. This would be like an NBA player going to a junior high school and playing against some little kids. LaMelo will treat Julian Newman how LeVar used to treat him in the backyard. Now, I do want to say congratulations to Julian because he did reveal that he will be playing his next year of basketball overseas instead of college. I guess whenever he's allowed to do so, because as you guys know, the world isn't really functioning as we're accustomed to right now. But I do wish him the best in that. But as far as playing LaMelo one-on-one, -on -one, stop. Okay, stop. I might be willing to put some money up that Flight Reacts. Yes, Flight Reacts. If you don't know who that is, go watch the video of Flight Reacts playing basketball. I might be willing to put some money up that Flight Reacts, he might be able to beat Julian Newman in a one-on-one. -on -one. He just might be able to. I don't know. What you guys think about this? And definitely subscribe.